What's going on guys? It's Caleb and I'm back with another video. So this weekend I went camping and naturally I spent a lot of time around a fire. As I was sitting there, I just kept thinking, man, I gotta do an illustration of this. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna break out the sketchbook, I'm gonna draw this, and I'm gonna take it over to the iPad using Adobe Illustrator, and we're gonna turn it into a vector. So without further ado, let's jump into it. So like my other sketch to vector videos, we start off with a sketch. I break out the old sketchbook and just grab a normal pen and doodle whatever's on my mind. Like I said previously, I spent the weekend in the woods and fire was on my mind, so that's what I wanted to take to the sketchbook and turn to a vector. Once I get the sketch where I want it, I take a picture and I drop it onto my iPad using Adobe Illustrator. It's really key to drop that opacity because it makes tracing with your lines so much easier. What I'm doing first is just laying the initial shapes. Once I get these in place, I can come back through and add more detail. Since fire is kind of an organic shape, Using the pencil tool on the iPad makes easy work and really helps me achieve the look I'm looking for. Now that everything's in place, I'm going to come back through and I'm going to add shadows and highlights. All I'm doing here is drawing little shapes and dropping the opacity. I do this for the shadows and the highlights. This is a quick and easy way to accomplish that look. Now I'm adding residual flames. What this is gonna do is just add some movement to the piece and make the flame look like it's flickering in the wind. Once I do that, I'm going to add a background and a little circle just to give the illusion that there's light coming from the fire. And this is pretty much where I'm going to want the piece. Well guys, here it is. Here's the final design. I had a lot of fun making this and I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. Well guys, that's all I got for you. If you like this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up for me. And if you want to see content like this in the future, make sure you're subscribed. If you want to see content like this now, you can just go back to my older videos. I have a ton of illustrations, logo designs, rebrands. Check it out. If you want to get a hold of me, I'll have my Discord link below. It's a great place for us to chat and just talk design. Well guys, I appreciate you being here and until the next time, peace.